This is sad if it's true. 49ers defensive tackle Kevin Givens allegedly assaulted a man named Hayden Bosley in Baltimore, Maryland on February 21, according to TMZ Sports. Givens has been charged with misdemeanor second-degree assault and could face up to 10 years in prison if convicted. Givens allegedly attacked Bosley in a hotel hallway, wrestled him to the ground, and dislocated his shoulder before Bosley escaped and ran away. The 49ers have not yet commented on Givens' assault charge. But they may have seen this news coming. Three days ago, on March 23rd, the 49ers signed veteran backup nose tackle Zach Kerr, a move which seemed strange at the time because Givens is the 49ers backup nose tackle and a good one. He showed promise last season and he just turned 24 a few weeks ago. His future seemed bright until this. Now the 49ers have another backup nose tackle just in case Givens is found guilty and the NFL suspends him. And who knows, depending on the evidence, the 49ers might even release him. What a shame that would be. Givens was an undrafted free agent in 2019 who played his college football at Penn State. He spent most of his rookie season on the 49ers practice squad, but made the team in 2020 after a terrific training camp during which he outshined former first round pick Solomon Thomas every day. Givens seemed like the player the 49ers hoped Thomas would become, an undersized interior pass rusher who wins with quickness and strength. And while Thomas was a disappointment, Givens was an inspiration, someone who made an NFL career for himself when it wasn't handed to him. Hopefully, he didn't just throw it away.